Hello and welcome to our channel. Today, we'll be discussing cerebellar hypoplasia in cats and how to care for a cat with this condition. Cerebellar hypoplasia is a neurological disorder that affects the cerebellum, which is the part of the brain that controls movement and coordination. The cerebellum is responsible for coordinating and fine-tuning movements, as well as for balance and coordination. Cats with cerebellar hypoplasia may have difficulty walking, running, or playing, and they may exhibit tremors or a wobbly gait. Cerebellar hypoplasia can be caused by a number of different factors, including genetics, infections, or toxins. It can also be acquired, meaning it develops after birth as a result of damage to the cerebellum. This can happen if a pregnant cat is exposed to certain toxins or infections, or if a kitten experiences trauma during the birthing process. It's important to note that cerebellar hypoplasia is not a progressive disorder, meaning it does not get worse over time. Cats with cerebellar hypoplasia can still live happy, healthy lives with the right care. So, how can you care for a cat with cerebellar hypoplasia? Here are some tips. Keep your cat indoors. Cats with cerebellar hypoplasia may have difficulty moving and may be more vulnerable to predators or accidents outside. Keeping your cat indoors will help keep them safe. Provide a safe and accessible environment. Make sure your cat has easy access to their food, water, litter box, and any necessary medications. You may need to make some adjustments to your home, such as adding ramps or steps to help your cat move around more easily. It's also a good idea to remove any tripping hazards or obstacles that may be in your cat's way. Encourage exercise and play. Exercise is important for all cats, and it can help improve your cat's muscle strength and coordination. Encourage your cat to play with toys or participate in activities that they enjoy. You can try using a laser pointer or feather toy to get your cat moving. Just be careful not to overdo it. Your cat may tire more easily due to their condition. Provide a balanced diet. Proper nutrition is essential for your cat's overall health. Make sure your cat is eating a balanced diet that meets their specific nutritional needs. If your cat has trouble eating or swallowing, you may need to switch to a wet food diet or use a feeding tube. Your vet can help you determine the best nutrition plan for your cat. Keep up with regular vet visits. It's important to stay up to date on your cat's vaccinations and to monitor their overall health. Regular vet visits will help ensure that your cat is getting the care they need. Your vet can also help you manage any additional health issues that may arise as a result of your cat's cerebellar hypoplasia. It's also important to be patient and understanding with your cat. Cats with cerebellar hypoplasia may take longer to learn new tasks or may need extra time to adjust to changes in their environment. With love, patience, and the right care, your cat can lead a happy and